Hi, I'm Todd Danielson, Chief Utilities Executive for Avon Lake Regional Water, here to give a recap of the board meeting from Tuesday, December 18th, 2018. We had both a work session and a regular meeting, uh, but I'm going to talk about them in, in combination. Uh, one of the work session discussions was on the uh, potential changes to our backflow program, which we're looking at doing next year. We talked about the idea of possibly giving a little bit of t extra time for people to get their backflow inspections in, but if they are not in in time, a penalty could be assessed. And then after that would be when water could be shut off. So that was a discussion that the board would be um, considering uh, further in the new year. Then really the most important thing of the board meeting, uh, first the work session, then the regular meeting, um, our rate changes coming up in 2019. As you may remember, we do have annual rate changes within Avon Lake, and I was asking for both water and wastewater rate changes, which that's, that's nothing different. Um, essentially what the board did approve is three years worth of water rate changes at about 4% change per year, but that uh, works out to an average of about five or six dollars a year for the um, average residential customer. Uh, wastewater rate changes are a little bit larger. They are actually 15% per year, which works out to somewhere around $45 a year uh, for the average customer. So all told, the rate increases for the average customer is about a dollar a week more each year. And essentially the reasoning for that, we've done $120 million worth of projects since 2013. And the debt service, the, you know, the, the, the payments for those um, are getting larger and larger. Our, our water debt service and our wastewater debt service are both increasing by on the order of $2 million a year. So these increases are essentially working to pay that off. Now, we have done other things to reduce the level of increase. For instance, with the millions and millions of dollars of 0% interest loans that we have received as opposed to the competitive interest rate that we would have received, which was around 2%, that roughly 2% savings has saved us $18 million in interest charges over the next 20 to 30 years. That works out to $55 per customer per year worth of savings that we've been able to achieve with this 0% interest money. And then also in the last two and a half years, we've saved two and a half million dollars worth of energy expenses. That works out to about $8 per customer per year. So all told, that's $63 per customer per year that we've saved. Um, now we are still, uh, this, the board still approved about um, a $50 per year increase next year, but that would have had to have been a lot more if we had not saved that money. So um, I, I'm a rate payer just like you. I don't like having to pay more, but we have to pay more to, to cover all of this uh, work that we've done. We've actually replaced, in addition to the major rehabilitation project at our wastewater plant and uh, the work, uh, the storage improvements project at our water plant, which was helping to address the icing issues and other things, uh, we have replaced 8% of the water lines in Avon Lake since 2013 and 12% of the sanitary sewer lines in Avon Lake since 2013. So major work that we've done. We definitely appreciate all of the uh, work or the, you know, the, what the customers have, have, have dealt with, with the construction that's ongoing, but our city is much stronger, much more resilient as a result of that. Also, the, um, uh, the board approved a change uh, or, or an engagement letter with, with legal counsel, um, McMahon to Gullis to, to assist with some, some um, like a developer agreements and things like that to help assure that, that we are working to, to make sure that, that new growth pays for what it should pay for. And then finally, just as a reminder, uh, many of you are getting your work done for any lateral work that you need to get done. Um, that uh, the uh, Group A homes, all work must be completed by April 30th of 2019, which is really not far away because I know the contractors are backing up quite a bit. Um, the Group B and C homes must have their inspections done by April 30th and their work completed by June 30th. And again, that is not far away. We definitely appreciate all of you who have done work so far, and, uh, and we ask those of you who have not to do that work as soon as you can. And just as a reminder, we do offer the 2% interest loan 
payable uh, with your water and wastewater bill if you do want to borrow up to $4,000. And if you do the work um, to separate laterals, to have water going to the clean water areas, the, uh, the, the storm sewer, and wastewater going to the sanitary sewer, we will provide the $1,000 wastewater bill rebate over a 10-year period. With that, I'm Todd Danielson, Chief Utilities Executive for Avon Lake Regional Water. Thank you and enjoy the water. Take care and happy holidays.